how do I get better in Krunker? By using Code Cat when guys are buying KR from the Krunker shop. It's one of the most asked questions that you guys are probably wondering right now. It's simple actually. Just play Krunker competitively, right? I mean, you are playing against players that are around your skill set or even better at times. Over time, you just naturally get better with tons of practice and experience. Maybe one day you could win a couple tournaments here and there. Anyways, let me help you start with your competitive Krunker journey. In Krunker, there's a tab called Esports, and this should pop up. If you don't see the Esports tab, you should join the official Krunker Discord, and there should be a channel called Scrim Servers. You should see these three options. NAC is for NA players. KPC is for EU players, CKA is for Asian players. Yes, there are some requirements to start playing competitively with these Discord servers, but it's not that hard to attain. Once you join the server that's best suited for you, it's time to get validated. I'm going to be using KPC for example, but the steps should be quite similar throughout the other Discord servers. Again, you need to meet certain requirements to be accepted. These are KPC's requirements. Okay, let's first link your account to your Discord in account linking. You don't have to do it here if you don't want to. You just need to be part of a Discord server that has GameBot to link your account. Type in g.link, then your Krunker IGN. I'm going to be using one of my alts for example, since I already linked my main account to my Discord and I want to give you guys a visual guide. Follow one of these two ways of linking your account. That was easy. After you're done, go to validate here and type in g.pf and it should do something like this. Here's the fun part. Now you wait until a moderator gives you your roles. 2000 years later. Finally, you either have a T1 or a T2 role depending on who you are and your stats. You can move up and down the tiers based on your performance. A quick disclaimer, NAC uses a different system of commands compared to KPC and CK. Again, I'm using KPC for example in this video but I will pull up subtitles if you were in NAC. However, this might change in the future, so just ask around if you need additional help with the command such. Before playing your first competitive game, make sure to quickly read over the rules of your server. Every pickup server has a designated queue channel. Type in plus plus to queue up or dash dash to leave. If you're in NAC, it's slash add or slash remove. Now you wait for seven other players to queue up as well. Once eight players are in queue, just react to the message. Then two captains are chosen based on their ranking slash elo. If you are a captain, you'll pick whoever you want on your team by doing exclamation point pick and your discord name. Slash pick discord name if you're a knack. The pick order goes B, A, A, B, B, and A. After the team are selected, now you wait for someone in your match to host or you can host it yourself by doing this. Make sure you're hosting the right region and map before setting out the game. The link to your game will be giving out in the link channel. Make sure to join the right one if there's multiple games happening at once. Then join the team that you're in. Since I am team 1, I'll join team 1. Select your class. Each team has a class limit of 1. Here's a quick explanation of competitive Krunker. It's a 4v4 hard point on a selected map. You have 4 minutes to gain as much points as possible. Whoever has the most points in the end will win the round, and it's a best out of 3. Once the game is over, the captain of the losing team will type in exclamation point RL. If you're in NAC, it's slash report loss. Hopefully this video has been very helpful. If it is, please give a like, and maybe one day we can play some competitive Krunker together. Peace.